we need an ultimate challenge. So we decided we're gonna do a push press. I tap, I tap. I only have like 80 pounds on everyone, so I really hope I don't lose this. What's up guys and gals, Noah Olson here. On behalf of Gymshark, we're about to do a strength test, one rep max, push press, conga line. Let's go. To wrap this all up, we need an ultimate challenge. So we can't do something too bodybuilding based and we can't do something too CrossFit based. So we need a perfect middle ground. So we decided we're gonna do a push press because it incorporates the deltoid strength of bodybuilding and the momentum and the athleticism of a CrossFit movement. So right there in this center stage, middle of the gym, we're gonna see who can push press more and we're gonna go all the way to failure. Now for me, I damaged my elbows the other day, arm wrestling, so my shoulder kinda hurts. I might cap out at around 25 pounds, but you get to see Chris bump that overhead press 405, so that's gonna look cool, let's go. You'd be able to lift the most weight if you did a split jerk, like that. Yeah, but we're not, we but we're not do doing that. that. Yeah, so push press, I would say feet under okay, your yeah, hips. Let's have that be the rules. Dip Just and like drive, that. lock out overhead. Starting at 115. Just a quick side note for the standard on a push press. Everybody has to have their feet right under their hips. You can use as much momentum from your lower body as you want, but you're dipping, driving the weight overhead in one motion. And we wanna see the finish with arms locked out and the bar in line with the body. Not out in front and not not locked out. So fully stacked head to toe. Take that green off. There we go. That would have thrown somebody off. missed that, Julian missed that, George missed that. 
but it was close and it was a lot of fun. So, uh, Chris, congratulations, my friend. That was a strong way to close it out. Yeah, the cameraman showed us how it's fucking done. I just didn't want to impede on the challenge. Like, I'm curious, so. Yeah. Oh! Damn. That man. I think it goes straight to 275. As one of my favorite bodybuilders would say, nothing but a peanut. interesting challenge. I think everyone lifted way more than I thought they were. If you paid attention to everyone's form, I think Noah had the most technically excellent technique and you know someone like Chris Bumpsley just has brute muscle strength. But you notice like someone like Noah when he got up to 275 which is two blue plates and a green, at the, he exploded all the way up but at the very end those few inches that he needed to lock out he just couldn't do because there just wasn't enough tricep there. And someone like a huge bodybuilder like Bumpset comes out, gets the weight over his head and then it just BAM! It just locks out. So that was a fun challenge. Hope you guys enjoyed the video.